Welcome to the Militia Gaming Community, I'm Trigger, and I'm going to show you how you can get 30 legendary parts every single hour in the Crew Motor Fest for ground vehicles except for drag racing. Alright, let's go! Real quick before I get into the video, if you're looking for a community of racers to play with, join our Discord. There's a link in the description down below. This is also where I do all of my giveaways, and we have every topic in there from the Crew Motor Fest, the Crew 2, to Need for Speed Heat, Need for Speed Unbound, everything Need for Speed, and all kinds of other racing games. There's over 14,000 members there, so hit that link and join us. All right, let's get into this. All right, some of you are already going to know this method because it has been circling around in the Crew comment sections of different videos, in Discord servers, and even in my comment section, but I have to put this video out because I've been testing a bunch of different legendary part farming methods for the last week and this seems to be the absolute best for basically all ground vehicles except for drag racing. I also recommend my other method for Street 1 and Street 2, although this method does work for Street 1 and Street 2. The other method with the Liberty Walk playlist actually works a lot better, so you can go and check that video out if you want, but you get a lot more parts with Street 1 and Street 2 with that Liberty Walk race. Anyways, in addition to that, a lot of you guys don't even know what this method is, so full disclosure i did not discover this method it was introduced to me by another youtube channel called maybe hopefully i'm getting your name right go show that channel some love his video is very much in depth it shows you every single step from not having any parts on your car to full legendaries on every single part category so again go show him some love i've got a link in the description down below his guide is a lot more in depth in this video i'm just going to show you the actual race and the path that you need to go on all right let's get into it it's fairly simple the first thing you need to do is complete the electric odyssey playlist because that unlocks your ability to run those races is in a custom mode. Before you start the grind though, you need to make sure you have your rewind setting turned off. It's in your difficult settings. Once you've completed that, go to the Hummer Express race and change the mode to custom. I'd also recommend adding the clean driving bonus because why not, it's basically free cash. Then go up and select the vehicle that you're looking to get parts for and start the race. So this race has no checkpoints. It's a point to point race, which means you can take whatever path you want to get to the finish line. That is what allows us to take advantage of some very generous paths and reset points in order to shorten this race to about one minute and 30 seconds on average. It's the key to everything. In this example I'm showing you though, you're gonna see me complete it in about a minute and 11 seconds and there are other people that can do it even faster. Now for the path. At the start of the race, just immediately turn around to the right and head towards this road. Then just follow the yellow path through the city and over the bridge. When you get over this bridge, you can reset your car when you get to this gutter in the street. You'll recognize the area because you'll see a green sign on the right side and the gutter on the ground in front of you, but it's basically just over this bridge. When you reset your car, it will spawn on this dirt road. Again, just follow the yellow line to get to this paved road. For pavement vehicles, I find it best to take the path that you're gonna see in this video. For off-road vehicles, you can actually cut to the right up here when you get to the top of this hill and then just head straight to the finish line if you'd like. Either way, it should only take you about a minute and 30 seconds and that's being super conservative. Some of the classes can get it done even faster than that. Once you get used to the path, you're gonna run it faster and faster. Now for some bonus strategies that will make this grind even shorter. Ideally, you wanna have the A-fixes, Goldfinger, and Lucky maxed out on every single part for the car. You can use this race to both level your car up and grind for legendaries once it is leveled. I've grinded this a lot, and it averages out to about one legendary for every time you do the race. Sometimes I get none, and sometimes I get three or four, but on average, it comes out to about one per race over a long period of time. And because this race takes about one and a half minutes, you're looking at being able to run it around 30 times per hour, if not more, if you're just resetting right away, which gives you 30 legendaries per hour. If you can manage to get a full loot digger set with the Lucky and Goldfinger affixes completely maxed out, you can get up to 40 or 50 legendaries per hour. Now keep in mind you will get duplicates, so don't expect a full Nitro Chemist set in one hour. There are 42 possible legendary parts for each vehicle, 
So it's still going to take a few hours to get a complete matching set with the same set bonus. But it's totally worth it because the alternative is just racing randomly and hoping you get it. Which honestly could take days, weeks, or maybe months if you're not focusing on it. The nice thing is though that this method can be used with all the vehicle types that I've listed here. Again, I don't recommend using this for Street 1 and Street 2. I've got another video that you can watch for that method. And once again, you really should go show some love to Maybe for this method. His video is very good, it's in-depth, and you should definitely watch it. If you're a beginner, it shows you everything from the start to the finish. So go check out that video and watch his other content while you're there. All right, if you have any questions about this method, don't hesitate to send me a DM on Instagram, Twitter, or Discord. I answer every single message. I read every single message that comes my way, and I personally respond. Thank you so much for watching. I will catch you on the next one. Trigger out.